everyone, and welcome to Gigi's very own game show, powered by Google Trend. That's right, it's Gigi's Trend Maps, the show where you guess what's on the map. Tonight's contestants are Tim, the Paladin 045, and Dom, the man with too many names. I can't mention them all. <laughs> and as always, your host, John, the Trendster himself, Davis. My favorite thing about your intro is how often you keep the mic full. Yeah. And how much it hurts. Well, thank you, uh, thank you. I'd like to thank everyone for uh, coming to such a momentous occasion, our premiere show. Um, I, uh, I'd like to uh, uh, hear a couple words from our contestants. So first, um, Tim, uh, brand new show. It's a brand new day. Um, how do you feel? Do you do you feel strong? Like you're gonna get in there and and take the W? Um, we'll see. It really depends on how BS these questions are. <laughs> all right, all right, we'll see. And uh, Dom, my main man, uh, how do you think you're gonna fare in all this? I mean, <laughs> I had no confidence until Tim said stuff, and now I feel like maybe I can win by virtue of him losing. <laughs> all right. Now that we've gotten an introduction out of the way, let's go ahead and introduce tonight's topic. Gender reveal parties. That's right. That's right. It's a little it's a little hot in the news right now. Uh, but you gotta strike while the fire's hot. Um no. <laughs> too soon. People are burning. <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's been a little bit of in case you're unaware, uh there's a little bit of news about some fires happening because some people would like to know the type of genitals their baby has and share them with the world. I don't know about you, but I don't care what your baby's genitals are. Ever. Ever. But now all of California knows it's a boy. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, uh, moving that on. My name so far. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to the first segment. So... We're going to be starting with a regular round of GG Trend Maps. Uh, you each pair a different word with the term gender. For example, and I'm using this word to kill it so that neither of y'all can use it, because otherwise it nukes the board. Reveal. So you would okay. pair each pair of words, so it'd be like gender, reveal, gender, etc., what you're going to come up with. Deliberate for 30 seconds first to come up with your word, then once we have both term pairs, we'll put it in, and the winner is whomever takes the most states. This is election style. Um, so, <laughs> we're going know, to that's accurate. pick a number between 1 to 100, we'll figure out who's going first. 69. 69, alright. Dom? What, what number are you picking? Hold Come on. on, there's only one number left between <laughs> 1 and 100. I mean, I can't do 420. <laughs> so do 42. Uh, 60, apparently. According 60. According to uh, the Wizards of the Coast dice roller. Well, according, <laughs> according to my physical D100 right. that I have here, the number was 34. So, Dom, you get to go first. Uh, I mean, you get to state your number or your, your word first. Uh, oh, yeah, it's going to be conceal. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a gender conceal party. All right, well, Tim, do you have yours? You, you had a little bit more time before you had to jump out there, but... Uh... Well, I had mine ready. <laughs> All right. Uh... So this is just the word gender and then something else? Yes, the word gender paired with another word. Reassignment. All right, so we have gender conceal, ooh, and gender reassignment. There we go. <laughs> there we have it. Let's see who takes the win. It's mm. going to be gender reassignment. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but mine but was funny. <laughs> it's true. Yours was funny. Um, it was definitely funnier. This is by virtue of uh, people have searched for gender reassignment. And California has searched for gender conceal. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess of all places, California wants the gender conceal party more than anything. Yeah. Where you don't start fires and you tell you nobody and then you swear yourself to secrecy for the rest of your life. 
Wow, okay. You make fires go out somewhere else in the country, and someone asks you why, and you can just stare them in the eyes and say, I had a baby, and walk away. <laughs> like, I had a baby, and they're like, what kind? And then you open your mouth, and then Eldritch scream <laughs> comes out. <laughs> All right, so um, by virtue of Tim getting all the points to Dom not having a single state up there. <laughs> Tim is in the lead now with 35 to Dom's zero. And we're going to move on to our second term. Um, this is going to be wildfires. So take 30 seconds and come up with your term. Tim, or no, Tim's in the lead, so Dom gets to state his first. Huh. It has to be one single word. Yes, one single word. Okay. I Pumpkins I will. No, <laughs> I I accept hyphens and uh, run on words. Although you are just pretty much taking a loss if you do a run on word. <laughs> Can you explain to me what a run on word is? Smokey the bear. <laughs> oh, okay, that's one word. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Um. Um. Camel caps as well would would be a a run on. <laughs> I'll accept it, but nobody's searching for it. Uh, I'm going to say California. All right, we have Wildfire California. Tim? I'm going to say Oregon. Okay. Oh, okay, so just kind of doing the same thing I did. That's cool. Wildfire Oregon. Okay, uh, California takes the win by a landslide because, um, just, oh, it, let me make sure. Because yeah. only Washington and Alaska care about Oregon. Th this is, to be clear, the, the... <laughs> wow. Wait, did Oregon even care about Oregon? <laughs> yes. Yes, okay. Oregon, Oregon cared the most about Oregon. Uh, let's, let's see. Thank o God someone did. Oregon only cared 4% out of, out of, about California, so... Apparently, the Oregon wildfires have actually killed more people than the California wildfires. That's not surprising, considering it was purposeful. <laughs> and also the population density. Yeah. I feel like more like there aren't that many people in California living in the forest. Yeah. Uh, additionally, I'm pretty sure California's used to it by now. Mm. All right. So uh, let's do scores. Dom gets 48 points. Uh, yes, because... Oh, no, well... All right, judicial question. Do y'all count DC? Because this counts DC. Um, I would say no, because we're not also counting... Uh, let's see, Cuba... Uh, we're definitely Rico. not counting Cuba. I think you mean we're not counting Puerto Rico. Yeah, that's the one I'm thinking. Um, All right. Or the Virgin Islands, or... Yeah, who else do we have that we shouldn't? <laughs> Guam. Uh, that we shouldn't? Uh, the United States. <laughs> <laughs> Texas. Texas. Hawaii. Um. All right. Well, Ed, that, was a, that was a good showing. Dom takes the lead from that. Now well, we're going so to... I have a question. How do the points work? Is it one point for each state that one, you have? One point for each state, yes. Were okay, so we're not doing this electoral college style where only California and New York count. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. <laughs> did Tim only get thirty-five points? I thought he had every state. There, uh, most of the states did not actually search for either of them. Yeah, they no complete... one in the state, not one person. It, it, if it shows up a null result, that's a null result. That's also the first time I've seen that in any searching of this. Um. All right. Uh, now we're going to do a round of geography feud. I will provide you with a term. You go back and forth, guessing the top five states to search that term. So in like this one, if it was Wildfire California, then the top five would be displayed here on the right. California, Nevada, New Jersey, Missouri, West Virginia. Um, so five points for top state, down through one point for the bottom state. You each have three strikes, and if you guess... The lowest of the 50 states, not counting D.C., to search that term, you get the bonus 20 points. Oh. <laughs> but, but good luck with that. So, so yeah. do we only pick one and we see where it lands in the 
top five? Yes. So, okay. well, no, I'm I'm giving you. I already know what the top five are. So okay. this is this is sort of like Family Feud. So okay. the 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 results are already found. You're getting the term, which in this case is um, fire. So the the term is fire, and I'm going to not show y'all, but uh, we'll we'll go back and forth. Um, Dom is in the lead, so Tim, you get first guess. California. All right. Well, guess what? <laughs> that was one of the ones on the list. That's actually um, the second on the list. Oh. Dom, you? So we just pick a state, right? Yeah. Uh, solid. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm Googling the list of states because I don't remember them all. Plasma! And uh, it autocorrected with the state of matter. So. Uh, well, I'm going to say Oregon. Oregon. All right, that's top of the list. Um, Tim? So we swapped. Yep. And I can't even um, say Alaska because we know Alaska cared about the Oregon <laughs> so I can't even try to pick them as the the fiftieth result. <laughs> See, I'm gonna go with the state of denial. Okay. <laughs> um, sure. Let's go with Alaska. Uh, sorry, that's your first strike. Okay. Uh, Dom. Are you staring at a uh, a map of, of the no, 50 a, states right now? <laughs> not a map, because I thought about that, but I feel like that would be cheating, because I can just pick in that area. I'm staring at an alphabetical list, so I have <laughs> nothing to tell me where the states <clears throat> are, so I really have to, like, this is the most fair thing I can do to know what the names of the states are. Um, Washington is up there. <laughs> All right, yes, Washington is number four on the list. Okay, so we have two, four, and... We have two, four, and five. <laughs> okay, the, two, the, four, or, and five. Yeah, yeah, well, we have we have one, two, and four if you're going top to bottom. Well, okay. um, we have yeah, the top, that's... the second, and the fourth. Yeah, yeah. So we still got two up there, Tim. Nevada. Damn Nevada. it. Nevada. Uh, sorry, that's your second strike. Wow. Get yeah. in. Thank God Tim picked that instead of me. It's even on the screen still. <laughs> um, see, that's weird, because I think Nirvana, Nevada would care about fires in general every day of the year. <laughs> nope. Nope. I guess Nevada doesn't count there to burn. <laughs> it's just... yeah. um, There's Vegas. That's about it. Yeah, that really is about it. Okay, since I, Tim, I'm ahead of Tim, Tim has two strikes and I'm low, I'm going to go try to get that 50th one and say Louisiana, because I think they're dealing with a hurricane right now. <laughs> so I don't think they have the time to worry about a fire. Sorry. Sorry. Um, yeah. do, do, you, do you think I should give a hint? I don't know what hint you can give that wouldn't be obvious. And I just How took about... a turn, which means it's Tim's turn, so you should wait until after Tim's done, and then you can give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna this is gonna sound self serving, but how about this? You give the hint when the person who has who is first on their second strike is about to give their next answer. Okay. That's fair. fair. Alright, um see that see that that doesn't work with the hint I was going to give. Uh but I I will change my hint, which will somehow be worse of a hint. It starts with the letter M. <laughs> mm, there's a lot of M states. <laughs> there are quite a few M states. <laughs> Eight of them. 16%. That's right, I know math. I'm going to say Missouri. Oh, Missouri sorry. That's your third strike. <laughs> sorry, Tim. Misery always looks up fires. <laughs> That's that common phrase. Yep. All right, Dom. You have one strike and uh, two more things to guess. Three if you count the bonus. 
trying to think of wet states that start with M. <laughs> wet states. Uh, uh, okay. Mississippi. Ding, ding, know. ding! That is yes. the bonus question! I knew they weren't literate enough to look up fire. My, my, um, hint no, was I'm going to be, you were close. I'm an idiot. Your hint was for the least likely state, not for one of the remaining five states. Correct. Yes. Yes. That, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> now I know. Yep. You'll know for next time. There's no way anyone in Mississippi Googled Mississippi Fire because no one can spell Mississippi even if you're from there. Yeah. <laughs> and even if you can, it's a lot of effort. No one wants to do that. <clears throat> All right. Dumb. So do I still have two more guesses? You still have two more guesses. Damn. All right. Uh, what you, else is in... You can, you can clear up and grab the last two of them. Yeah. What's in the Northwest? I think the way you spell Mississippi is you drop a golf ball on the right side of your keyboard, and while it's bouncing, you just hit S a bunch of times. <laughs> <laughs> but only in pairs. Yeah. You have to make sure there's a bounce between each two. Bounce, yes. SS. Bounce, SS. <laughs> Did I say Colorado? Colorado is... I'm not 100% sure where that one is, so... It is the last one on the list. So, oh. uh, you, you got... You got a point for oh. that. All right, go for the 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 middle of the the bunch. Where else could you go to an organ trail? <laughs> and you place it. It's basically all of the places on fire is the end results of an organ trail. <laughs> What's the one? I just had one. Oh, uh, I'm gonna go with Ohio. Sorry. Was one Idaho more? the last one? Uh, no, Dom still has one more guess. Uh, I'm going to go with Idaho. <laughs> no. <laughs> Idaho, <laughs> Idaho is not one of them. The, the last one was, oddly enough, Montana. So let's see if that's still true, because I looked at earlier Where today. Where the hell is Montana? Oregon, California, Montana, Washington, Colorado. Good. It didn't Montana change. Montana is just to the right of Idaho. Yeah, it's right here. It has huh. a search interest of 38. It's weird that they care more about the fires than Idaho when it has to go through <laughs> Idaho to get to them. All right, let's see. Yeah, but there's not much of Idaho right there. It's, it's a little. Oh, yeah, it's very thin. Yeah. I guess potatoes don't burn very well. <laughs> You're right. That's probably true. All right, and so Tim is at the bottom with a score of 42. Dom is in the lead with a score of doing math. Uh, 75, right? This is starting sure. to feel a lot like number wing. I, I think yeah, I, 75. I'm not 100% sure where the points are coming from, so I just believe you. All right. Uh, back to a regular round of GG Trend Maps. Your word is now party. Party on, guys. Patrol. <laughs> party patrol? <laughs> No interest from anywhere. <laughs> uh, Tim, you get to state yours first. You've got probably another 20 seconds to, to come up with something. COVID. COVID party. All right. Hey, that's, I'm horrified. That's, that's, a, that's an actual <laughs> that thing. Reaction. That, that is an actual thing that is horrible. I do like the yeah. fact that um, the presidential primaries are also a uh, <laughs> option. <laughs> All right. You've seen what the red team's doing. I want to say my answer is going to be Democratic. <laughs> Democratic Party. Okay. <laughs> Honestly, not probably not a bad showing. I mean, I don't know which one out of the two would get me more. So. Oh what? <laughs> yes. That one apparently. <laughs> Well, I mean, Democratic versus Republican. Wow. <laughs> Apparently, Massachusetts is really worried about Mas this. Massachusetts and Rhode Island. <laughs> Why are those two? Wow. Is that third one a 51%? Yeah. Uh, honestly, Rhode Island is at a 50%, but it it apparently no, has, like, it. it's just enough over that it, it gave it to you. Uh, same with the last one. Mississippi was the lowest with a search score of 8 um, but so was most of the southeast. But it just 
because of other unseen issues, it it put it down to that. So, uh, Dom, <laughs> wow, <laughs> yeah, really, really taking it away here. Um, yeah, <laughs> you're at a score of one, two, three, and uh, Tim, you you budged hey, up to forty. <laughs> <laughs> all right um, i need you to do what you did for the first round and stop trying <laughs> all right in the first round <laughs> now we're going to do a round of international geography i will prove oh, that's bad <laughs> i only know france and burkina faso that's all i've got in my, in my international vote now. I will provide you with a term. You tell me which country searches for it the most. 10 points, sorry, 20 points goes to whoever is closest geographically as best as I can tell. <laughs> so, you know, I know there's curvature. We're not yeah. dealing with that that much. <laughs> so um, say Greenland, because that could be any size. Yeah, no one would yeah. have big Greenland. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and your term is going to be blue for the color of the fire that caused all of this. <laughs> uh, the color of the smoke bomb, rather. So the term is blue. Oh, that means the baby was a Democrat. <laughs> um, <laughs> right? I think that's how these parties go. <laughs> and you are telling me, and, and it's still Tim going first, what country is closest... To the term blue and no it, it has not searched this is so, so basically we're trying to guess which country has has searched blue more correct <laughs> does it keep in mind language i don't know <laughs> i would doubt it i would doubt it yeah All right, Tim. Okay, that actually complicates things because there aren't many adjacent English-speaking countries outside of North America. And I feel like the ones that there are might not have as big of a population who uses Google. Remember, there's there's Australia and all of Europe speaks English as well. So. Yes, but there's a lot less of them per country. Correct. <laughs> Hold on, Tim, you give your answer while I Google blue a lot to <laughs> All right, Tim, I need your I'm answer. Going to, I'm going to guess the U.S. All right, you're guessing the U.S. Dom, what is Damn your it. answer? I skewed the results in Tim's favor. <laughs> Wait, I need, a, I, I, I need to download... <laughs> <laughs> a VPN? <laughs> need to download a VPN. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'm going to go with my gut that is a very bad gut answer and say France. All right, so let's see helps, what the response is. also are. my gut answer. Is it the, they say soccer blue? The correct answer is actually Canada. You know, I guess that makes sense because they were the closest to the fire besides us. <laughs> so the top answer is Canada. Followed by Argentina. By Argentina. <laughs> and then United States. But oh, geographically, geographically, Tim is the closest, so he gets those 20 points. Yay, I get any points ever. <laughs> hey, you've I gotten got some point points. Yeah. Not much, but, you know, some. All right. Now, for our final round, we are doubling the points. And we're going for a regular round of GG Trend Maps. Your word is boy. And again, all point values are doubled, so anyone can take this. And the term is boy. Tim, Bobby. you're still at the bottom, so... You get to give me your term first. You've got another 20 seconds or so. Again, boy, uh, this is not because, you know, uh, boys are better or anything. It's because apparently boys cause more fires this year. <laughs> I hate the chain of logic here. I feel bad for that child growing up and everyone's been like, oh, you're the child that burned the yeah. entire West Coast. 
All right, Tim. Let's have your your turn. Mm. I feel like California is too easy. You know what? I didn't actually. But I need that. these points. Okay. Um, I don't think anyone has searched California this time. We're we're not allowing uh, duplicates. So, uh, I th no I have my answer. no didn't you? No, we didn't search you, California. You, you did search California, right? Okay. Wildfires. Um, yeah, yeah, we right. did. Yeah, so California yeah. and Oregon are off. Okay. Um. Remember, Tim, this is not like your game. It is actually <laughs> term connectedness. Like you, you... Yeah, we're not going to search the voice magma. <laughs> Great. Now that's in this show. <laughs> I am I'm not pressing that one. <laughs> All right, Tim. I'm going to say little. All right. Little boy. Gotcha. Uh, just so you know, it does treat it interchangeably, so it doesn't care whether you have boy in front or after. Uh, Dom, what is your term? Florida. Florida boy, okay. It's like Florida man, but it's younger. And... Whoa! A huge upset here! Tim takes 200 points! <laughs> Wow. <clears throat> and takes the lead. Wow. I think it's just 100. Oh, you're right, right. You're right, my bad. Uh, I uh, I doubled that too much. I doubled it, and then I doubled it again. 164. He takes the lead. Tim is our first trinster. And uh, you will like go on. fair because I won all of the rounds. <laughs> you won all of the rounds. <laughs> yeah, well, we got to have something in there to make it, you know, still tense I'm at the fair. end. Yeah. yeah. Fair. Um, all right. Well, uh, thank you for coming. Uh, how do you how do you feel, Tim? Um, I feel like I somehow cheated a little at the end there, but I'm not sure how. <laughs> all right. All right. Well, uh. We'll, we'll see you next month for another... Wow. Thank you, someone, for blooping us with something. By someone, you mean I... Oh, oh, hi. Oh, hi. ...points that Tim beat me with. <laughs> <laughs> and um, uh, we'll see you next month. Tim will be up against a new contestant. Tim, as our reigning champion. Oh, he didn't get kicked out. That's dope. That's why I didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll we'll cycle people back in as people win and or lose so uh thank you everyone for coming and we will see you next time bye bye